Hey folks, Quill18 here. Welcome to another episode of Let's Play Some Cities in Motion 2. Again, I don't know if we're going to complete the uh, the scenario. We're going to we're going to give it another good go for the next part though. Apparently, we've got a new quest. This guy wants 3 trams purchased. Well, we'll see about that. Like, doesn't he see that we've already got tons of trams? I'm not convinced that we need a crap ton more. I mean, we won't need more until we build more sort of lines. Um because we're, we're definitely at the capacity of our need. I suppose we could start running them more often, but we don't have that much of a passenger load already. So, I don't know, we'll see. I mean, I do I do think another tram line down this other avenue would actually have tremendous value for us, but we'll see. Now my buses, meanwhile, there's a lot of demand for them over here. Tons of weight, bus line number six. Let's start running you more often. Every hour and a half. That's oh, because it's that really, really long route, which is probably going to cause me all kinds of problems. <clears throat> we'll see. I suppose what I can do, these places that have bad maintenance problems, I could actually just, um... I could actually just add more vehicles to their pool, because some will rest for a while between loads, right? So there's always going to be that surplus kind of kicking around. I have to worry about things being overflowed, but otherwise... That might not be a bad idea, say here, for example. Especially, let's, let's throw in a couple of double-deckers. Just to help deal with some of the overflow capacity, but some of these buses were in kind of poor condition, as I recall. That's this nighttime stuff. I don't know. I don't know what you're, what, I'm not sure what to do about this. Uh, it would also be nice to be able to change the bus line um, sort of... Depots... Stops, yeah. It'd be nice to be able to change all the line timetables in bulk, but I'm not sure that there's a way to do that. I mean, you can copy from something else, so that saves some amount of effort. Oh, it's the weekend. That's the part of the reason. Uh, well, no, weekends just have a different schedule. Yeah, I don't know. All right. I guess we can increase the intervals on weekend. Maybe that's what part of the problem is. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Nice work, casino's buzzing. Alright, so we got some money. Right, you want the tram stuff? Yeah, well, we'll see. I mean, he only wants me to buy trams. Which is not the end of the world. Like, just out of curiosity, the cheapest trams are, what, 800? So, yeah, that, I mean, it'll pay for itself, but I don't really need them right now, so... I'm not gonna go rushing off to do that. I think that I will build uh, a bus depot over here to service this area locally. And then we'll see about getting things connected. So, bus... Um, Basic bus depot is probably enough. Oh, they can't cross the road because it built the full intersection. Or I can build it at the intersection. Which might be much better. I hadn't really clued into the fact that I could do that. Alright. Um, we'll have it exit and take a right as it leaves. Start by setting up one loop. That's actually going to cover a fair amount. I'm not not convinced that we need to worry about the stragglers uh, too much. So um, it'd be nice if there was a way to start a line right from there. It just feels like there should be. Create new, and we will we will keep them shorter. I'm pretty convinced that now that that's the way to go, whenever possible is short. Oh. Start at the depot. Build these shorter routes. They're better for you. Healthier. There you go. You can end there. And then... We will... Yeah, alright. Let's add a trio of buses. What's this quest for? Build bus line to a detached house. Okay, we'll have to check to see where that is soon enough. Then we're going to create a new line. Add go there. We're going to click there. This is going to be your crossover traffic. And then it's just going to service... Actually, hold on. Cancel, cancel. Add. Here. To there. To there. And then in there. Good. 
And then we want to add something that will connect the two. We're going to start here. And we'll sort of make those stops. Those, those are big crossover stops. And then... something like this. And yeah, I'm sure it needs more vehicles. In fact, we'll throw in a few bigger ones as well. And hopefully that'll be enough. Hey, I got an achievement unlocked. Transportation is the business. All right. And then I could set up some simple routes that connect over here. I feel like this is a bit long. I don't know. I guess it's fine. Or maybe what I'll do is I'll build a bus depot somewhere here to service kind of this area and this island, and then this will have some routes that go over to the island as well. That's probably decent. We'll build it in the park. People don't need, don't need parks, right? Parks are useless? I'm pretty sure that's true. Uh, this is definitely going to be a big one because it's actually there's going to be a lot of routes involved over here. Like that. Um... Let me just build these sort of major stops over here, both directions. Oh, there's a stadium over here too. That's that's going to be a big traffic destination. There we go. So we can get in and out, um, and then we'll put uh, little big stops here. Okay, because then what I can do is start my route, create a new line, add a line, we're going to start from here. Qua. How is there no valid route? Oh, this is a freaking footpath! Son of a... God damn it. It is, isn't it? What's well, called an avenue, yeah, pedestrian street. Curses, foil again. Um, okay, so bus stop, big bus stop. Here's the big bus stop too. It's like that much more expensive. Awesome. Uh, so the latest bus line has nothing on it. Good. We're gonna go here to there. Oh, that's just gonna be so awkward. To here. Speaking of awkward, that was that was poorly designed. Who designed these stops? Who refuses to change them now that they're down? Alright, let's go straight to the medium ones. Not to mess around with the small ones anymore. Uh, so there's that, and then we want to create a new one. That goes from here. Add so from here to there. To here. there we go. Very similar route. Then adds it there. Okay. the message about tram depots not having enough and I still have the quest to actually buy trams so if that keeps up it's not it's not a bad thing doesn't seem to be that many people waiting actually so it feels to me like it's more of a question of I'm running the timetable let's go back to the three hour thing which one's bus depot number four this one no that's five. Oh, this one yeah that makes sense one more. See how that works. Okay, where was this quest? Where was this detached house? Did I... 
when I hit escape on these, it closes, or am I hitting reject every time? Because it's sure as hell going away. Does it really have to cover the same line? Well, I guess we could do that. the line just for this guy. I mean, we're going to be expanding things here later, so that's it's not like as terrible as it sounds. Actually, on this island is probably a good place for the depot. As long as I don't accidentally cancel this quest. Oh wow, I don't even have to convert or uh, transport everyone anyone there. I mean, we as well, we as well, me as well, throw a couple of buses on there or something. All right, a third bus. I don't know how much demand there'll be right now, but later once it's connected to things, it might actually be worthwhile. So we're almost going bankrupt, so that's good. Too expensive. Holy crap. Too expensive to be worthwhile. Oh, why am I messing with the trolleys? Alright, what do you want? Oh, you want more trams. Yeah, well... You want more coverage. Yeah, I don't know. The coverage must be based on, on population. Because there's no way we don't have 15% of the map covered by some sort of stop. It just makes no sense. Uh, what is that? Oh. Alright, you can have another tram. We have the quest. You can have another couple of buses. We'll see how it goes. Okay, let's um, let's go ahead and build another bus stop or bus depot and a big one. And build a little sort of. Oh, that's one way going that way, huh? A nice loop going there. That goes that way. Alright, Quest, hold on a sec. Hold on to your shorts. I need two buses? Really? Tram depot number four. I mean, uh, maybe, maybe the trams aren't running at capacity and I shouldn't be buying the more expensive ones. Department store, department store. That's a lot of money. Hold on, hold on. I was going to say no, but that really is a lot of cash. <clears throat> here, here, here. These three places. You know, we could service that really well from just this one depot that we've already got going on. I mean, this this route is going to be a little silly, but once it's you know kind of connected to the rest of our network, and this one's actually going to cover you know some of the tram stops, and that's quite good. <clears throat> Something like that. So 
let's say okay before I accidentally kill that. Um, and then create a new a new line. Starts here. And we'll put the three down. They, apparently they do reorder, so that's good. Like so. And it does need some extra vehicles, so let's throw those on. Just the cheapos, because I don't think the capacity is going to be that much of an issue. Although, I mean, it is shared with the other one. We might have to set some, some priorities and things. We'll see how that goes. You know what I'm going to do, actually, on this line here? Because there won't be that many passengers unless we, we really hook it up to more sort of useful sort of side routes. I'll have a touch there so that there'll, there'll be some interplay with some of my other connections. So there'll be some value there. Um, and what we can do over here is add a couple more bus stops just to cover more of the population here. That, yeah, I was gonna say, they're gonna need a couple of more buses. I'm totally random if I decide to buy the big buses or the small buses or whatever. That's just the way it goes. Um, I would like to bring in more traffic to different places. Are these? These are apartment buildings. There's a nice mix of things. You know, frankly, starting in the outskirts may have been a mistake. Maybe I want to start with the stuff right in the center. Let's, um, let's go ahead and create some more sort of interesting and useful bus lines. Still think new bus lines should start in ad mode. I really don't know why they don't. There we go, a common stop. And it's running, although I'm sure it's going to want more vehicles soon enough, and that's okay. Let's, uh, let's throw some stops down here and have that serve as that. Um, I think there's some interconnections going on over here, I hope. So this is going upwards. Oh no, it's a two-directional road. Okay, I thought it was a one-way. Planning it on having it go. Well, I don't know now. I guess something like that will work just fine. Money? Well, we're not bankrupt yet. <laughs> Certainly getting there. things. No, not bad. Okay. Economy. It's freaky when all the lights go out when uh, nighttime hits. Build one line. I mean, the from shouldn't matter, right? Or does it? Does the ordering make a difference? 
I don't know. Holy crap, this place needs a lot of vehicles. Well, it is servicing a lot of bus lines. Yeah, I'm not sure. Too new to this game to really know all those intricacies. <clears throat> Alright, let's drop a bus depot over here. Oh, I probably should have built the big one. Eh, this will do for now, but yeah, we will want the big one later. Um, okay, let's go that way around. It's not great coverage, is it? Again, we're trying to feed our tram line as much as possible. <clears throat> yeah, we'll get back to the ticket prices in a sec. So we've already got a bus stop there. What is that being serviced by? Oh, this sort of thing. Starts from here, leaves and goes down this way. That is a lot of unhappy campers over there. I did not expect it to become that busy. People waiting to go. Bus line seven. Really? What day is it? I gotta move the thing. It's, it's Tuesday, so it should have been running plenty. Maybe just not big enough stops or buses. I don't know. Prefer prefer large vehicles, and maybe that's gonna help. Oh yes, the ticket prices. that this jacked up so high like this. Tram Depot, okay, well that will hopefully finish. There we are. A little bit of bonus cash, although I'm about to go bankrupt, so hooray. Well, that's why you'd take out loans, but what the hell, man? Bus Line 7? Crazy. Let's throw a couple double de deckers on there. And I think that I've already specified that it prefers large vehicles, yeah. So the bigger the better. Hmm. Hopefully it starts to take that into account. Although I'm doing the thing where I said, like, don't do it, like, where I'm just throwing extra vehicles at the problem and hoping it resolves things. Uh, financially, we're totally screwed. All right. Uh, you know what? Let's cut back on these wages. Oh, that's not actually.
actually being that helpful, is it? I want to catch thieves, but I'm broke. It's mostly energy costs. That's what keeps killing me on these buses. Too many buses, too many drivers. Oh, if I had fewer buses, I would save money. So if I were just buying the bigger buses. Hmm, interesting. Yes. Hmm. Yeah, throwing more buses at the problem is definitely not the solution. Part of the problem is there's no good way to sort, like, the size. I don't know, I almost want to start turning off the, like, crappy small buses. Yes, more quests. Build a line to the villa. Um, well, that would be really easy to do, actually, from over here. I, I think I will do that. This and then, because you know I don't have enough like buses and crap, and that's you know so many problems. Maybe I shouldn't base things so much on buses. Maybe I should have started with metros. That's an interesting question. You know, maybe they're just much much more cost effective. Boom! A little bit of cash. Okay. Yeah, we need we need more of those. We need more quests, and not like stupid ones like this one. I don't know why. As far as I know, they're all being serviced, right? And they're all on the same line. Bus line 15. Bus line 15. Bus line 15. It's all one line. Something about the order of the stops? It's it's got to be. There's got to be something, right? I'm thinking about just canceling that quest. Maybe it'll increase the chance of getting another one. Let's do it. Okay, what I need to do actually is assess bus um, bus lines that aren't making me money and run them less often. There's an idea. Uh, transportation. By line. So let's start from the top. It's a messy job, but yeah, see, this is losing money. Every four hours. They're all, they're, are they all going to lose money? Pretty much. Maybe I just got to start charging more for my buses. That's the thing, like, I've got, I'm, I'm worried about these stops that are filling up. Um... But a lot of times my buses aren't actually full. It's just a question of, I don't know, things not running very efficiently, or... I don't know. Because that one's breaking even, that's not so bad. Is there... like, I've got my economy panel. I've got graphs and things. I need something that shows me... that lets me see all my vehicles by... It's a lot more overcrowding. Like, show me all my vehicles based on how much money they make. We're not vehicles, uh, lines. Super profitable. Actually, hold on. Let's copy from line one. There you go. Let me just hit that button instead of. like crazy. Ah! 
sometimes this UI starts to become less than ideal. 17, I guess we'll just load them all up. Like that. Copy. Copy. Actually, this one's not losing money. Tell you what, you can keep running every two hours. It's fine. Okay. Fast forward. Let's see how we do. And we still have the excess buses, but I think we'll need less drivers and less energy cost. So there's really... Okay, well, some depots must have an excess of vehicles kicking around. You have two extras. One, four. There, all right. We're going to grab a couple of your buses. We're going to transfer them to depot number six. Like that. Actually, can I just, like, drag and drop? No. There we go. Use that to try to resolve some of our issues. There's a lot of people on this one tram. Wow. I think part of it is probably that I've screwed up my, my trams, you know, somehow. Bus line number 20. Makes money. Runs pretty often, actually. Maybe I'll just have it for larger vehicles in case there's an option. No, okay, my trams are actually, like, have a lot of people on them. Frankly, we could almost just use bigger trams, too. I mean, not everywhere. And I guess you don't want to overdo it. Again, you know, some unhappiness is okay. You tolerate a certain amount of unhappiness. And then there's more graphs, right? Like, I can look at um, all kinds of stats, like city population, unemployment rate, who's using my stuff the most. Apparently, tourists? Really? Interesting walking rate, number of trips, like, there's so much stuff, but, ugh, I don't know. So there's some unhappy people here, but there's not, like, a ton of unhappy people, right? It's, if you're starting to see, like, double-digit people waiting places, especially once you get above 20, like, that's a fair amount. Bus line 15 should almost be making money. Maybe what I should just do is encourage people to use, like, multiple transit types, because then they'll spend more, right? If we start adding, I don't know, water taxis, or water buses, I guess they're called, right? Boats, ferries. What do you want? Skyscraper, one line between skyscraper and office building. All right, we can... Oh, we actually don't have a bus depot way over here. Still, we could, okay, we could do the cheaty type of thing, right? Where we've just got, like, the one, the two. It's a long route. But maybe it's going to be okay. Create new so we can start them. Where's the depot over here? Here. Make sure to include... Oh, we're not including stops. Of course not. Of course not. Because why would it launch me in the mode that I want to be in, like, 99% of the time? Plus that. God damn you. There. There. long fracking route. Alright. And you definitely just run every four hours. 0% complete. How is the first part 0% completed? Or is the completion based on the number of people who use it? Is that all it is? Well, that would be very frustrating if that were true. Wow, is this bus ever freaking full? Oh, it's bus line 7. The famous bus line number 7. Always has lots of people waiting for it. Let's, let's increase the, um, the frequency, because we could probably make even more money on that line. What time is it? Oh, it's time for bed, guys. I gotta end this here. 
Uh, I will try to come back and play this city some more. Although, since I'm so close to bankruptcy and I'm certainly have screwed this up, I'm a little leery. But I'll try to uh, I'll try to come back at least one more with maybe more tips about how do we actually resolve some of these issues. It'll be interesting to read the comments. Like so far, I've just played in one straight go, right? So uh, any comments that have been made on the videos up until now, I haven't read them because. You know, I haven't posted any videos yet. Um, but before the next set goes up, I will have read some some comments. So it'll be really interesting to see if anyone's got any uh, any tips. And make sure in the comments to specify whether you've played the game or not, um, because you know if you're just sort of guessing, then that's you know I'll try them. Well, look at the traffic. Wow, now it's starting to look like SimCity. Um, I will I will use that. But if you've played the game and you know for sure that something works, that's like really super duper helpful. And actually, what's super duper helpful is if I start looking at this traffic and start seeing, well, where are people going? Well, there's a lot of places that don't have coverage, so that's probably a big part of it. Um, and yeah, there's a lot of stops at zero. There's, I don't know. Probably just need a lot fewer buses in general on most lines. Just a line to the grocery, right? Really? The, well, the grocery is covered by a line. So it just needs pensioners to actually go there. All right. There's still not a whole lot of people waiting here, which either means like my buses are awesome, or I um, I started entirely the wrong area. You got some buses available. We're gonna move you to depot number eight. Alright, so that wraps this up. I will see you guys next time.